I gave the Foreign Affairs Minister two opportunities to condemn the increasingly common and terrifying anti-Semitic chants we hear in the streets. Israel will soon be gone. There is, no, there is only one solution, intifada revolution. Twice she refused to condemn those remarks. She continues to pander to Hamas supporters in the Liberal Party as part of her leadership campaign rather than doing her job. So I'll give her another chance. Will she publicly support Israel's right to retaliate against the tyrants of Tehran and the terrorists in Hezbollah and Hamas to protect itself? Yes or no? Yeah. The Honourable Minister for Foreign Affairs. Mr. Speaker, if there's a day where we don't do politics about people's lives being taken or people being killed, it's today. We are all against any form of anti-Semitism, I hope, in this House, any form of discrimination. And I really hope that my colleague in front will apologize. The Honourable Leader of the Opposition. If there was ever a day when we needed a government to stand up for what was right, this would be that day. Yeah. has sought to divide Canadians by saying one thing to one group and precisely the opposite to another group. And here in this House, remaining radio silent on condemning anti-Semitic chants and on supporting Israel's right to truly defend itself by retaliating against the terrorists and tyrants. Why won't she do the right thing and stand beside the Jewish people today? Yeah. The Honourable Minister of Justice and Attorney General. Mr. Speaker, one year ago in the Middle East, peace was broken by a violent terrorist attack by Hamas. On this side of the ocean, we deserve to do better in terms of the protest that we articulate. It needs to be peaceful. What that means is you don't go out on the streets and target a daycare. You don't go out on the streets and target a community centre. You don't go out on the streets and target a synagogue. Our resolve to fight anti-Semitism is strong. It has been strong since this parliament started when we outlawed the will for promotion of anti-Semitism. It is even stronger now when we're advocating for more strict penalties, which that party opposes. 